Our topic for today is all about designer fashion or costume jewelry from the brand Dior, Hermes, Chanel, and more. And if you want to see my collection, my thoughts and experience, are they worth it or not, please stay tuned. everyone welcome back to my channel thank you so much for the tune in once again this is MC I do videos about luxury fashion beauty lifestyle anything under the Sun <laughs> any topics that you want me to discuss and if you are new here I would love if you subscribe to my channel ring the bell and get notified every time I upload new videos like I mentioned earlier I will be showing you my costume or fashion jewelry which i acquired over the years but i don't have much in my collection because i'm not really a fan of fashion jewelry i'm a type of person who loves to wear uh, whether bold or dainty but fine jewelry i have done several videos about my fine jewelry collection and it's no brainer fine jewelry is designed for long-term use and you can pass it on to your family members or to your kids you know and it's also one of the best investments especially when you are not a fan of handbags or even investment properties i would advise that you invest on this fine jewelry because um you'll not only enjoy them but you can save them for future emergency why am i talking about fine jewelry <laughs> our topic is about costume jewelry so yeah let's just go ahead and uh, discuss about it so if you ask me what do i prefer uh, fashion over fine of course everybody um almost everybody loves uh fine jewelry but then again, sometimes we cannot find the design or the style of the pieces we love. That's why we resort to buying uh, these items from the fashion jewelry market or retail or uh, pre-love even. And um, for me, I have some factors to consider before I buy. Number one, um, I choose classic or iconic pieces because if I d decide not to wear them or if I don't want them in my collection anymore, I can uh, sell them or even give give them to uh, my loved ones, you know. And then number two, the costume jewelry has to fit my lifestyle or suit my lifestyle. I also set a budget because I don't want to spend like over one thousand dollars for a costume jewelry and um i'd rather buy a handbag or uh scarf or belt or you know uh, we have so many fashion luxury accessories and the question here is is it worth it for me yes it's worth it only on specific instances or certain occasions where I need to accessorize an outfit and I can only achieve the look I love by wearing a costume jewelry. It all comes down to personal preference at the end of the day. And um, another reason is costume jewelry for me is a nice way to incorporate a dazzle or flash, uh, sort of diversify my collection. So most of the time I get it or buy it because I like it and uh, i want to collect certain pieces from the fashion house i love so 
this is my small collection of fashion jewelry i will not be mentioning the price of each piece because i don't have my receipts already but if you are interested to know you can check them on their websites this is the Swarovski SS Lovely Bracelet Cry Rose M and this has a sparkling Swarovski crystals and a heart charm with lock. Such a pretty accessory for everyday use. I like the adjustable lock as it fits any size. This is the large stamped necklace in sterling silver and in the size 17. I purchased this from a fellow YouTuber, jewelry designer Jill Mower. I just love the look of this unique piece. The clasp is amazing and has an M which stands for her initial Mower. This Shariol Bangle Forever is inspired by Celtic torque adornments. It's a stunning and distinctive bangle from Shariol's ever popular forever collection. I like to stack this with my Shariol Saint Tropez watch. This Chanel Classic CC Crystal Earrings, large size and in yellow gold tone, is such an elegant looking earrings, ideal for special occasions because they are a bit heavy and large. I had no problem about stones or crystal fall off so far. The Dior Jadior Choker in gold tone, aged metal. It is great for stocking with other necklaces and I love how the pendant and chain lock do not tarnish and it's adjustable. The cute tiny CD charm completes the look of this choker. Shariol, Celtic bangle, and cable earrings with charm. The hoop earrings are strikingly simple yet ultra sophisticated. So it's from the brand signature finely twisted cable motif. The bangle is a signature piece with a highly polished gold plated end pieces. This timepiece can be adjusted to find the perfect fit. Over here is the Bottega Veneta woven bracelet. This purple leather bracelet features a woven texture and a branded metal charm derail. Such a cute piece for a casual outfit. I love the color as well. Here is a set of Christian Dior Jadior bracelets, otherwise known as Dior Friendship bracelets. They are woven bracelets in wavy or navy cotton. The length is adjustable to fit one's size. Again, this is great for casual outfits. Now, here is my Hermes white enamel click H narrow bangle in palladium hardware. It's in the GM size. I love to stack this with my other white gold pieces and watch. Such a lovely piece of accessory. My Hermes black enamel click lock H bangle with rose gold hardware. It's in the GM size and as you can see, it has some scratches but I don't mind because I've worn it a lot. I wear it day and night with any outfit. I absolutely love it. So that's it. And if you like this video, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up. If you have any questions or suggestions of what topics you want me to discuss in my future videos, don't forget to notify me in the comment section down below. And thank you so much once again for watching. I hope you've enjoyed. I'll see you next time. Bye.